October 9, St. Louis Bertrand. Louis was born in Valencia, Spain, in a family of nine children. His good parents brought him up well, and he became a Dominican priest. He was very severe as the master of the novices, but even though he did not have a good sense of humor, he taught the novices to give themselves completely to God. When first he began to preach, it did not seem as though he would be very successful, but his deep love for souls brought great results. At the age of 36, St. Louis left for South America. He stayed in the New World only about six years, but in that short time this great apostle baptized thousands of persons. Although he knew only Spanish, God gave him the gift of tongues, so that when he spoke, all the different tribes of Indians understood him. Yet his apostolate was not without dangers. A tribe called the Caribs of the Leeward Islands even tried to poison the saint when he visited them to preach the gospel of our Lord. Once he was called back to Spain, St. Louis trained other preachers, teaching them to prepare themselves by fervent prayer first of all. The last two years of his life were full of painful suffering, but he still kept preaching. Finally, he was carried from the pulpit to his bed, and he never left it again, for he died 18 months later. Success in life lies in generosity and prayer. Today I will try to overcome my selfishness and say my prayers well.